There once was a year so vile and rotten that holiday cheer had seemed all but forgotten. There were no festivities in the current movies and shows, all except one, and this is how that tale goes. "'Twas the night before Christmas, and all through the house. Not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse." No, I'm going to go. I want it to be get here. Out of my way. Get no, out of my way. Okay. What the hell? Okay. Right, you so, over here. You over here. Right, right. right. Come on, Wait, man. okay, so one, two, three. All right. <sighs> We're good? Hello, and welcome to the Hayner Family Christmas Special. 2020 has not been a good year for anyone, and we just want to wish you all a happy holiday season. In lieu of sending holiday cards, we put together this little special to share with the people we love. We each have a... We each have a segment with which we spread our holi- with which, with which we spread our cheer. Merry Christmas, everyone! Don't say that. Don't say what? Merry Christmas. Say Happy Holidays. It, it's better for the people who Guys, don't celebrate. Guys, can we not fight for like five minutes? Can we pretend to like each other? You don't have to get grumpy about it. I'm not getting grumpy. You're doing it right now! Happy holidays, everyone. Let's start this show. And now, Christina's History Corner. Hello, my name is Christina Hayner. As I'm sure you're aware, 2020 has been (laughs) quite the year. In fact, 2020 has been such a year that it has seemed like 10 years in one. Because of this, I would love to share the highs and lows with all of you at home. It's mostly low. All right, now it's time to read from the Necronomic, the big book of 2020. Here we go. What about the 2020 election? All right, the election. Um, okay, so next is my segment. Enjoy. And now, what's cooking good looking with Dylan Hayner. Hello and welcome to the Christmas edition of What's Cooking Good Looking with Dylan Hayner. I'm your host, Dylan Hayner. And today we're going to be making a nice classic Christmas roast goose. You're going to want to preheat the oven to 420. And then, while that's preheating, you're going to want to grab your mise en place. Wow. Now, mise en place might sound fancy, but it doesn't have to be. Wow. In fact, let's just give our carrots a nice rustic chop. Uh, I like what you're doing here, but uh, get here. I see one major flaw in your plan. What is it? Carrots! are not cookies. I know, I wasn't making I'll, it. I'll help. He sucks, doesn't he? Why is he still here? Oh. That looks about good. I will let you get to it. Yeah, baby. Um, okay, so. As I was saying, all you're gonna need is a nice rustic. Oh! 
what are you doing? Ew. Carrots can be eaten whole by reindeer. What about the cookies? I know, I wasn't even making cookies. But how will Santa know that we love him? That's incredibly stupid. No! Yeah. Okay, so... Santa needs love! No. The power of love! A few moments later... But you don't even have... Do you make them from scratch? More moments later... Please don't tell mom. Please don't tell mom. Much, much, much later... That's all for this week. Come back next week when I make more cookies. Great job, Bob. Let's watch mine next. And now it's time for another installment of Doug's Movie Rants. Welcome to another edition of Doug's Movie Rants. On today's special holiday episode, I'm going to be talking about a movie that I consider a Christmas film but that might be a controversial take. You're I'm gonna, gonna talk about Die Hard, aren't you? No, I'm not gonna talk about Die Hard. But it's an awesome movie, why not? Yes, I agree it's an awesome movie, but at this point, it's almost hack to call it a Christmas film. Being a hack never stopped you. Back to the depths with you. Anyway, today I would like to talk about the 1983 comedy Trading Places, directed by John Landis, co-starring Dan Aykroyd and Eddie Murphy, and in a brilliant piece of cinema history, Jamie Lee Curtis showing her boobs. What? No, it's true. After being typecast as a screen queen for her first few films, she never showed any skin. This is the first time she ever went nude on film. Dad, you're being sexist again. Mom, Dad's being sexist again! Wait! Wait, I'm not being sexist, I'm just being honest! This is the Stop. first... This is the sexist police. Oh, Christ, not again. What you just said may be true, but come on, man. Film history? I mean, you're not talking about her contributions to modern society, or her, even her acting. You're just talking about her body. Yeah, but... Boobs! Talking about women, based solely on their looks, is not cool! Be better setting a bad example for your kids. A few minutes later... Plus... There's blackface in that movie, man. Now back to your regularly scheduled programming. So... You think that could be like a lesson to you, huh? Does not matter! My turn! Now it's time for Owen's epic show of explosions and awesomeness. What's going on, my gangsters? It's your boy, Owen Hainer, back at it again with another epic stunt compilation. Now, make sure to smash that like button or I will break your kneecaps. Alright, let's get right on into it. Okay, so we're going to start off with your basic wall run. You've seen Sonic do it. You've seen The Flash do it. And now, you're going to see your boy do it. You got it? What? You got to say cut when you... The scene's done. You get, come on, we've been over this a hundred times. How do I cut again? No, 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 just stop. No, 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 look at... It. All right, guys, we got that in the bag. We got it? Cool. No, wait. All right. So, we just got it. And by it, I mean the wall run, not the talking head. OK? OK. So now we're going to move on to some insane parkour. Isn't that what you just did? I mean, technically everything I do is, but that's what I'm good at. So I just thought we would do more. You're good at it? Jesus Christ. So is this not enough for you? What do I'm gonna do? F jump over a car? 
That would be pretty cool. Yeah, actually, you're right. All right, gangsters. We're gonna end this video with the most epic stunt ever. I'm gonna jump over this car. Oh, and Wesley Hainer. What the hell do you think you're doing? Uh, I was just gonna... You, you were, you were just what? You were just gonna jump over this car? Excuse me, I am not going to the hospital during a pandemic. I thought it would be cool for the special, um... Yeah, what, the Christmas special that maybe 10 people are gonna watch? Plus, what the fuck does this have to do with Christmas? Yeah, I guess I got a little bit... You got it? Cool. No, wait! Closing out our cheer, I'm going to leave you all with a holiday classic, The Twelve Days of Christmas. Christ, that one is so damn long. Uh-huh. And a one, a two, a one, two, and on the first, first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. On the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me two turtles. <laughs> And a partridge in a pear tree. And thus ends our story. So cheerful and festive. Dylan made cookies. And Doug was arrested. But that's all in the past. And now everything's all right. So happy holidays to all. And to all, a good night. Come out to the coast. We'll no, have a few no, laps. No, no, Dad, Dad, we can't do that. Yippee no. ki yay! No, that's still the same. What? Thing. What if? What if I do Hans? No. Oh my no, God! No, you're no, one of the. No, Mom said no, Doug Hard. I'm going to the vets. No, no, Dad, you're too fat for that.